Welcome to Manicam Tutorials. Have you noticed how all the pros in the world are using multiple video sources to capture our attention? Well, today I'm going to show you how to become one of them by just using Manicam. Here we are. Let's open Manicam together. Very good. Well, Manicam makes adding video so sources super easy. Let's start with the right click on an empty source. This brings up a few different options. At the very top will be your normal camera, the webcam. Then we have the game, we'll go into this a little bit later. Then we have IP cameras. IP cameras show any cameras you have connected previously. These cameras can be set up in different locations to make sure you capture the best angles. They work really well for interviews or self-published videos. For how to connect your IP camera, uh, see the link in the description below, I'll post it for you. Let's move on. Manicam Mobile. Well, this one uses your mobile phone as another camera. This option is one of my favorites because you can move your phone around at the moment, either express yourself in a selfie mode or show something in front of you. We have done a step-by-step -step tutorial, by the way, on how to connect your phone to Manicam. So I'll post the link in the description below as well for you. All right, so by clicking on media files, the next one here, yeah, you can add in any prepared images or videos that you have on your computer. This is really great for breaking up your videos with other interesting content. Now when going live, Please make sure that your media files are ready to go beforehand. So here I can actually add some. Let's have a look. So for example, this one here. Transition and voila. Perfect. Let's go back. Since the most things are on YouTube, instead of keeping videos on your drive and choosing media files, you can actually simply add the video you want by inserting the YouTube URL in there. So you just insert the URL, then click OK, and then you're ready to play your video. All right. The next option is the desktop. This one will allow to screencast your desktop, just like I'm doing it right now. There will be another tutorial on how to screencast with Manicam soon make sure you don't miss it. So you can see all these features explained in detail. Right, so lastly, there is an option for a blank image, this one here. If you click on this option, you'll be able to choose a background color you like. Ooh, that's difficult to choose. Let's go for purple. <laughs> oh, so beautiful, love it. I'm going to choose my webcam for now. Hey! <laughs> nice! Remember that Manicam free desktop version allows you to add two different video sources. The standard version allows you to add up to four and the studio and enterprise version of Manicam allows you to access an amazing 12 video sources with another four sources from your phone. To see the other awesome benefits of Manicam standard or Studio Enterprise version, check out the link in the description below. That's all I have for you this week. Thank you very much for watching. Get creative with different video sources. I know you can do it. And if you're curious what Tati is bringing you next time, well, subscribe to our channel and stay tuned.